Jermaine O'Neal making his debut, second quarter action, taking on the Cavs. He would take the pass, lay it in, then he shows off little range, pops the J, takes the feed, shows off the hop step, drops the bucket. He had 11 on the night. Now Mo Williams making his debut for the Cavs. And this was a good acquisition. The second score lays it in. Later on, Bosch hits an open. Anthony Parker, he drops it. Raptors up by four. They keep coming. Jose called him up. He gets open, hits the J. Then O'Neal to Parker. He'll get it to go. And one. Then it's Bosch working on Ben Wallace. And he works him over with the jumper on the break. LeBron only played eight minutes in this game. He goes behind the back. What a pretty pass. Then LeBron hits Ben Wallace for the open two-hander. He was dishing it tonight. The Raptors, though, too strong. Chris Humphrey gets the bucket. He had 14, then CB4 with a jumper from the top of the key. The Raptors get their first win of the preseason. Now, this game was not broadcast anywhere, hence the limited highlights. I find it kind of surprising. They broadcast LeBron's games when he was playing <laughs> high school ball. I'm surprised they didn't do the preseason. Only LeBron, Chris Bosh, Jermaine O'Neal, you know, a bunch of nobodies You in know there. what, though? Looked pretty good for the Raptors. Their starting lineup was O'Neal, Bosh, Jamari Moon, Jose Calderon, and Anthony Parker. O'Neal, by the way, finished with 11 points, 4 rebounds in 20 minutes. Andrea Bargnani, he had 15 points. More importantly, he had a team high eight rebounds. They say he wants to be more physical on the inside. He certainly did that tonight against Cleveland.